Hey guys, it's Duran and I am here today with a couple of hauls, a quick update, some chats. Um, let me just get started. So one, don't forget that my online virtual um, 31 gifts party is going on right now. The link will be in the description box below for you guys to shop. Um, that's going on until this Saturday at midnight when I close the party. Um, thank you to um, Brenda who uh, was my first sale ever. Yay! super excited um if you guys like anything that you see in the catalog please consider purchasing from me and if you're considering being a consultant it's a good opportunity i mean even if you don't um, become an active consult uh, consultant selling stuff it's just great to get all that stuff for like 99 dollars plus shipping of course but and tax but i mean it's all that stuff is well worth over 300 dollars as you could have seen in the other video um so yeah that's going on now i just wanted to remind you before i forget number two um, thank you to, what is her name? Thank you to, do, 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 do. and then no, uh, Ingrid, who messaged me on Facebook, um, wishing me luck with the 31 gifts thing. And also she complimented me, say, asking me if I lost weight. Mm -mm -mm. So, um, yes, I have lost weight. Um, let me just tell you, it's not been easy, um, for the past, like, four weeks, I've actually been watching what I eat, uh, for the first few days of this, I, I cut carbs completely, which was really hard, because I love carbs, um, but I know, I read so many diet books, I've tried so many diets, I've tried everything, and I know, I know for me, that carbs is my total kryptonite. It is the one thing that I could just like, God, my eyes are so red. My contacts are bothering me. I have an eye appointment next week. Anyway, um, carbs are the one thing that I just like can just eat a ton of. So, and I know that that will just go straight to the belly because that is where I house all the fat. So I cut carbs out. Um, I don't completely not eat carbs, but I don't eat like, I haven't eaten candy in a month. I haven't eaten... I did sneak a little bit of a brownie yet today, but um, I don't eat potato chips. Um, if I do eat, like, pasta, it's like, you you know how they say a serving is like a fistful? Yeah, that's how much, my fist is small, and that's how much I eat. Um, try not to eat too many french fries, basically no bread. Um, yeah, uh, it was hard in the beginning, but once you get over that hump of being irritated and nasty to people when you cut out carbs it's actually you don't feel like you crave carbs anymore and actually it feels good and it feels good to start losing weight and seeing on the scale the pounds dropping off i have a um a private uh, fitness blog or weight loss blog that i have but it, no one has the code or the password to it but i start it for me um just so that i can keep track of myself and Da, 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 da. I joined a gym this week. Yes, I did. I joined a gym and I have went once and I'm hoping to go tomorrow morning and try the U-Jam class. But I did go, I signed up on Monday, had the kids try out the kids club. And then I went on Tuesday to um, work out on the elliptical. Um, I was so sore. I haven't worked out in like, since when I got ready for my wedding, nine years ago. I haven't gotten I haven't done anything besides walking around the block here and there like I haven't done any of that so it felt good to check it off my list and I'm feeling good to check it off my bucket list of things to do before I turn 40 which is a couple years from now I look 20 right 21 maybe um yeah so yay for that um what else can I tell you guys um I'll update you with that U Jam class. I'm kind of intimidated. I'm really, I haven't taken a choreographed class in a while. I took Jazzercise back in 2000. That was fun. Low impact. It was fun, but I'm a little scared. I, I took a class at 24 Hour Fitness <laughs> like um, years ago, probably 10 years ago, 12, 13 years ago. And it was a, I don't remember, a step class or some aerobics class. And she yelled at me. She got in my face and was like, do it! And I'm like, I'm scared of you. So I don't like to 
do classes. I am traumatized, I think. I don't like people yelling. When they were giving me the tour of this gym by my house, um, she was like, what kind of classes are you doing? I'm like, classes where they don't yell at me. She goes, so I guess you're not into boot camp. Hell to the no, I'm not into boot camp. I don't want anybody yelling at me. I think of Celebrity Fit Club and like how, what is his name? That guy, Coach or Sergeant Harv, you all know, you watch Celebrity Fit Club. Um, he would yell, I don't like that. Uh, tell me I'm doing great. You're doing awesome. Keep doing what you're doing. Not, not do it. Um, yeah, so yay for that. So my goals are, I'm going to tell you my goals that I put on my blog, but my goals are, um, I've already lost nine pounds, woo -woo. um, but my goal is to, if when I lose five more pounds, I can buy new workout clothes, which is exciting. I buy clothes from Target and have some older t-shirts that are beat up, but I want to buy cute clothes like Lululemon and Victoria's Secret and Nike and all those things that are cute not like old t-shirts for my husband <laughs> at the gym um when i lose 10 total pounds not from the i mean 10 from this nine pounds so 10 pounds so five more pounds off of the five that i lose i want to buy a new wardrobe because i need new clothes um because hoping i'll drop a size or two i'm like hoping Um, but yeah, it's not easy. I take it day by day. Um, dieting is no fun, especially when everyone around you will be. You have been bombarded with Father's Day, a uh, birthday party. This weekend we're going to a birthday party. We're going to Benihana. And like, it's not easy. I just have to be really strict with myself and know my portion control sizes and just be really, really, really mindful of what I eat and what goes in my body. Okay, so the fun stuff. Um, I got a couple hauls to share. I know you guys are waiting for the hauls. So, um, my hauls. I'm in my pajamas. This is my nightgown. <laughs> so if you see a subsequent video after this and I'm wearing the same thing, yeah, because I'm taping back to back. Um, hauls. Where do I start? So I got my Techie Tuesday Allie Edwards stamp of the month. I don't know about this one. It is called Fun in the Sun. It's the June 2013 stamp. That's cute. I don't know if I use it. I honestly... God, is it bad that I'm, I'm not a stamp hoarder? I'm a collector. I'm not even a collector. I would use it if I have a better way of organizing, I think. But I think it's cute. This it, It's not my favorite, but it is cute. I like the We Love Sunshine one. Um, the heart summer one's cute and the fun in the sun. Those are cute. I'd use those if I remember to use them. So I'm still a few weeks behind on my project life. I'm going to a crop on Friday, so hopefully I'll catch up. What other things came in the mail? Oh, I got this off of Amy on YouTube at Love My Ella. Um, she posted her Cricut cartridges. I guess she's moving to a cameo and she posted her Cricut cartridges for sale. I think we're she sold this. Amy, you crazy. She sold this. I think it's linked, but it's, uh, I don't mind. I mean, I barely use my gypsy, but I do use it. Um, Jolly Holidays. Woo! I got this for, Amy, how much did you sell this for? Uh, 15 shipped? Is she crazy? This thing goes for crazy amounts. Crazy amounts. And I got this for 15. So thank you, Amy, for that. So excited. Um... What else? I don't remember if I showed you these two stamps, but I did get them from someone on the scrapyard. Um, snorkels by CC Designs. She's so cute with her little snorkel. I like that. So cute. And Brigida with Popsicle. Cute. Brigida is my favorite. And you know what? I do love, I think some, these are my first sets from CC Designs that are already pre-cut. Hallelujah! Thank you, CC Designs, for pre-cutting your stamps. Because let me just say, this is a time saver. My stamps don't stack up. I'm actually willing to actually stamp with a stamp block immediately instead of like, oh, I want to use that stamp. I 
gotta go and cut it out. Yeah, that's me. But, um, because you know there are some stamp companies that need to get with the program. I'm just saying. I'm not mentioning names. But yeah. Pre cuts. Awesome. And then I got from the Greeting Farm this baby onesie die. I thought it would be bigger, but it's so cute. It is the the actual onesie is three by three and a half. It's so tiny. Look at that. And then there's little collars, different collars, just like a little waistband and a little bow tie. Cute. That is cute. There's a contest over at the Greeting Farm Facebook page right now about decorate that onesie die by June 30th, I want to say. And you get to win $50 to the greeting farm. Hmm, I might try it. But the fact that it's so small, I don't know. I'm like, I don't know. And then I got Charlotte Chic from the greeting farm. She's a new release for this month. And she's so cute. I love her. She's so cute. She's like got her little fro going on with her natural hair and her little off the shoulder shirt like she's going to the club in the 70s. I love it. Can't wait to color her up. Um, Chic Tags had a grab bag sale. And y'all know I love mystery box grab bags. So I had to try it out. I don't have anything from Chic Tags so you can believe that. Unless it came in like a Studio Calico kit. So I um, thought I'd purchase the large grab bag for $20. And let's see what's inside. I haven't opened it yet. I think she tags is comparable to L Studio, L E Studio. So these are labels. These are. Everybody is texting me. Um, labels. These are arrows set of 10. From the 25 days collection which i guess i'm assuming is a christmas themed collection cute this is birthday cake and these are file atc's set of six so that's what it looks like oh that's cute oh that's cute favorites this year love this about you notes and remember this so they're horizontal they go like that but here you can see the back of it and it has all the so the six cards. This is Everyday Life Journaling Cards State ATCs. Cute. Like that. That's the back. This is Everyday Life Date Tag set of six. Ooh, cute. Little details. Oh, this says today's favorites are every day. Our stories are moments. Everyday moments. Today's highlights. Cute. Everyday Life 2, A and B tags. Ooh, love it. Am I enabling you specifically, Rashida? You know you wanted this. I should have told you about this. I hope you got this. Because I know you. You were going to say, girl, why didn't you tell me Everyday Life this week's ATZs? <coughs> Cute. This one is Drilling Tags Road Trip Circles. And they're different sizes. Cute. This one is A Camping We Will Go Bunting the Alphabet. I'm super excited. This was only 20 bucks, guys. Seriously. Everyday Life 2 Note Clips. It's Your Day Birthday Cake Scallops. Everyday Life number tabs. And it's that on that side. Chevron tabbed ATC's journaling tags. So the tabs are Chevron. Bond Voyage. And there's like a plane, a ship, cruise ship, da da da. This one is Everyday Life 2 cards. I'm excited. Hello, January. Although it says hello, months color. So there's got every month on that. This one is vintage note stamps, journaling tags. Holy heck, this is a lot, guys. 
spring doilies embellishments. So there's like different colors in there. It's like doilies. This one is everyday life weekdays black embellishments. So let's get that out of black. This one is I can't get this down. Something lace borders. Date place lace borders. It's like a rainbow. This one is camping we will go icons. I hope we get to go camping this year. And uh, once labels and embellishments. Cute. That was all. That's not bad. That was like a lot for 20 bucks. That's a lot. I think it's a lot. It looks like it was just as fun as the LA Studio grab bag that they do. I think they do that. When do they do that? Once a year around Christmas or Thanksgiving? Then finally on Blitzy. God, this video is getting on, on Blitzy. Um, they had the Delusions ink sprays. Holler at your girl. So you know I had to go get some sprays. Um, am I still getting recorded? Sorry, the screensaver popped up. This one is London Blue. London Blue. That's in my hand now, the Fergie song. My London, London, London. Okay, so that's London Blue. After Midnight. Is it going to be purple? I'm assuming it looks purple. So I got almost every single one. At least the ones that they had in stock. I didn't have some of them. This was Crushed Grape. This one is Cherry Pie. This one is Cut Grass. So these were, I think, $3.33 each. Not bad. Squeezed Orange. Pure sunshine, bubblegum pink, like my shirt. And this one is melted chocolate and vibrant turquoise. I'm loving turquoise right now, so I use turquoise like that. And three more black marble. box red and fresh lime so I got a total of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 and I think there's like 5 that I don't have I'm not sure but yay 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 for Blitzy so I'm waiting on that gotta round off that collection <laughs> I was actually thinking about um, getting into Lindy's Stamp King sprays and they had a sale this weekend but I said no because I had these I had the Heidi Swap ones and I have Mr. Huey's that is it no more sprays no more paper no more sprays donezo gotta get done with it um so yeah that is it hope you guys stuck through me if you guys stuck through me with this video hooray if you didn't because you got tired of me talking See you later. <laughs> um, thanks for watching. I will do another video soon uh, about my Ask Me Anything video. I still have to answer a bunch of questions. Um, I still got to uh, do a bunch of other stuff. My to-do list is never ending. But yeah, don't forget to shop my 31 Gifts party. And I will talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye.